Tonight, friends, family, and fellow brothers in blue gathered to remember Chesapeake officer Timothy Schock at Awaken Viewing. Officer Schock died last Tuesday during dive training in Oak Grove Lake Park. Ten on your side's Jason Marks was there as loved ones arrived to pay their respects. Jason, it's been an emotional week for those close to Officer Schock. Absolutely, Melanie. It's been tough for everyone in the community, but really taxing for his fellow dive team members. They're the ones who knew him best. They spent so much time together, both in and out of the water. He loved life. He loved, uh, loved being around people. There was a constant flow of people coming in and out of a Chesapeake funeral home. People from all over stopping by to pay their respects for a man who dedicated his life to protecting others. Tim touched a lot of people's hearts. He's, he's been with the department for quite a while and he knows a lot of people and a lot of people knew Tim. Chesapeake police officer Tim Schock died during dive training last week. He spent 16 years on the force, half of that time on the dive team. He loved work, you know, he loved what he was doing and uh, he loved the dive team as well. Schock's loss has been hard on the department a department that has seen its share of loss over the last couple years. It's a rough process to go through. Uh, unfortunately, this is our third time going through this in the past six years, and and uh, it's just it's unfortunate when the community loses a uh, community servant like like Tim Shock. Tonight, the mood again was somber. It's been a uh, a long week, uh, a gut wrenching week, and um, you know we have to get through the next couple days. Shock was known for his love of life. But in all this sadness, just the mention of his name could put a smile on anyone's face. Tim was the guy that always made you laugh. So, you know, whether it was uh, throwing a movie line out there or, or throwing a joke out there, Tim was always, uh, always willing to do that and make somebody smile. Tim was a uh, terrific guy and he's uh, an extreme pleasure to be around. The pain from this loss will slowly go away. But the loss serves as a painful reminder. It's a uh, surreal event when it happens and um, it brings back uh, humanity. You know, puts it into focus really quickly. And things don't get any easier for the department. Tomorrow morning, they'll say goodbye to Officer Timmy Shock. It starts at 11. His funeral will take place at Mount Lebanon Baptist Church on Las Gaviotas Boulevard. Of course, 10 on your side will be there for tomorrow's service. We'll show you the tribute to Officer Shock right here starting at noon. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.